So, on, if you were president, what are the five major things that we'll you would do? We'll fire out first. Five major things. Yes. Me, oh, my, my president. Yeah. Me, the tourism and the development of Ghana. Me. I have watched and watched closely, carefully, all successive governments, with the exception of Nana and what I say, we with this. A year, year of America, return. Year of return. Yeah. But he has not done anything with tourism because that is not where he has to start from. Okay. Let me give you tourist sites that can give us money, mm -hmm. gold, more than the gold. Because the number of people that came to this uh, year of return, the money that they spent were over a billion within this Short, seven days yeah. or eight days they were here. Mm. How many months would it take you to dig the ground here and get the gold? How many? The whole Ghana, our cocoa, gives us what, about 1.5 billion. And in a week or two weeks, we got a billion yeah. spent. And you saw the economy so vibrant. People were selling. Yes. Tourism. I will use tourism. Okay. Number two, whether you are a grandmother, grandfather, or you're a minister, <clears throat> you make a mistake, I'll fire you. Favoritism and nepotism will cease. We you're gone. Fired. You'll be fired. You can bring Jesus Christ, I'll fire you. We you're a minister. My fire to set example for those who will succeed yeah. you. That even Mr. A, who used to be a good friend of Ken, has been fired for doing the wrong thing. It sends a signal to those subordinates. Three, interest rate. Wherever we are going to make interest rate attractive to businesses, so it's industries. Yeah. Industrialization. Industrialization will go on when interest rates are low. Yeah. Interest rates in this country. No president will come and succeed without this interest rate going down. Really close, 26%. A great bank is saying 26%. Commercial bank is saying personal loan 23%. We are not going to succeed. Four, agriculture. Mm. We talk of agri agri. We need large-scale farmers in this country whether we like it or not advanced countries as rich as they are they subsidize their farmers mm. that is why rice are being imported into this country cheaper than the locally produced rice five is technology okay technology we cannot do away with technology those are the five things yes that you would and, concentrate on and move this country. for your four years yes but it's four years enough yeah, four years is enough because look at what uh, President Kufuado did with this, uh, what? The year Asporians, of, year of, year of returns, returns. Yeah. the Asporians coming in. Mm. How long did it take you guys to do it? Oh, months. But yeah. we, we lay the foundation. And what you do in four years will give you a mandate for the next. Okay? Okay. I'm sorry you are leaving. If not, I would like to explain tourism. Yeah. What you can do to make money first mm -hmm. my first tourist site to attract people mm. is elimina and cape coast castle okay we need to dug and expand the hole that this the tunnel that they were going through yeah you take pictures of the tunnel the original ones and frame it there open it up we we'll buy a boat and put it on the end of the tunnel mm. And you know the name of the boat? What would it be called? It's, a, it's going to be a restaurant. Okay. It's called Point of No Return. Mm. The boat is called Point, Point of, of No, no Return. Return. Yeah. It's a beautiful boat with restaurant that when you buy the ticket to go to Elimina Castle, it's a packet. Mm. Elimina Castle will take you that when you sit in the boat, restaurant, live band, music, mm. will take you all the way to Shama and come back. And bring you back. Because we said point of no return, you will not go through that tunnel again. You take another entrance. Right. How would Cape Coast people make money? We need affordable hotels. 
Hotels have about 17 taxes. We will scrap it. You tell me KMA is coming for tax. KMA, what does KMA do for this hotel? Tell me. EPA coming for tax. What do EPA do for the, uh, this hotel? Okay, so many taxes on hotels. That is why our hotels are so expensive. Okay. Hotels, take VAT. Mm. Ghana Revenue Authority, case closed. Ghana Revenue Authority should be able to take care of all those. Uh, others, I mean, what, what, yeah, other yes, taxes. What yeah. did the EPA do? What are they doing to come and take tax yeah. from the hotel? Standard Authority coming to take uh, and put it in the box. Please. They make hotels so expensive. We have to make hotels affordable. Babe, let's go. We are sitting in the gold mine in Upper East. Mm. Wa area. Yeah. From Wa to Laura. You see elephants. We need to build beautiful, affordable hotels. And wire, electric wire, about 400, 500 miles Around. is money. But we have to raise it. Because when President Kufuadu was determined to make free SHS free, he got money to do it. Let's get money to go to that Mule Park. Mm. 500 miles, let's wire it. Elephant, lions, monkeys, deers, giraffes, giraffes, boo, whatever, e everything. Put them in. You create a path with trucks. They have their guns going around every morning. People will go in and look at where the lions are, where the elephants are. South Africa, that's how they are making money. Yeah. From tourism, yeah. they have places to go. Paga Crocodile Pond. President Kufuor attempted it, but he had to leave because of two terms. We were in Maryland, and they showed this. As a Ghanaian, I didn't even know until we got to Maryland where a crocodile, they will bring chicken like this. Take it, and human beings will sit on the crocodile. Nothing will happen. It doesn't happen anywhere in the world. Mm. This is gold. Now, the question is, how would somebody drive all the way to Paga mm. and drive back to Tamale? No. Put a beautiful, affordable hotel there. They can spend drinking beer, whatever, women coming. Eh, whether Nightlife. Can go to, women will come. Prostitution was there before anything. Sodom and Gomorrah. It is not you, the pastor, coming to change us. We need to build the country. Make people work. Make people make money. I went with a lady from Chicago to... Where is that string? You go and climb, walk across it. Kakum Forest. <laughs> the lady went up there, came back, and asked me, so Ken, that's all? What's here? I said, ah, and you mean you want me to bring tourists from Chicago only to come and watch this? No. When I say tourism, the aviation industry is going to boom. When you buy the tickets from wherever you're coming from, mm -hmm. your package, if you are going to Mole Park, as soon as you land here, there's a flight straight to Wa. When you get to Wa, you have these beautiful buses there waiting to take you. You first check in at the hotel. Not why it's so, but where Mole Park is. is yeah. We build the hotel there. So the buses will take your things with you to Mole Park, check in, then you get the tour guard to take you around. Yeah. That is how we make money. When we say tourism, how will people come here and poor roads? We have to fix it. When we say tourism, how would I get here? An internet will not work. Hmm. See, so when I use tourism, yeah. it will trickle it will down, down yeah. to all these things. Surprisingly, in this country, tourism is relegated to the background. Yeah. And we are not making money. That is gold. 
why everybody is going to Dubai? Tourism. Why? Because of tourism. They, they... Just here, Marine Drive, beautiful hotels. We put it there. We will use Asia Miracle to build these hotels. Public and private partnership. Make it affordable. Mm. First, Dubai was cheap. Now I go to Dubai and Baj Khalifa Amani Hotel is charging me $3,000 a night. Wow. The address is charging me $2,000 a night. Wow. So now I opt for Intercontinental. 600 something, 700. Beautiful, big apartment. Nice breakfast, nice scenes. We can do it. We need to challenge ourselves. Mm -hmm.